is have a book called The World is Flat, about how the world is not more and more like Noah's Ark, full of representatives of all the species, all the peoples, on, on one spaceship Earth. Sometimes I say, we all live in a yellow submarine. <laughs> So a little bit about Africa occurs to you that could, could interest our people and, and uh, something about India. Then we can go into the, to the proper attitude to approach more peace of mind so we don't stress ourselves out and lose our happiness. Something of Africa, something of India, that we can go to a better way to enjoy our lives, not be so frazzled or tight about it. Oh, okay. <laughs> <All right>. <laughs> <laughs> journey to this this path is very interesting to me you know um, I was a college student like many of you and your big dreams you know rosy world in front of me and thinking to make something different than Ever, you know, and one of our teacher, uh, my my physics teacher, I was fan of uh, physics, you know. He he he, he was practicing uh, yoga, and I got interested to in the meditation to him. So you know, all those information were, were coming from the west all over and we are dreaming of uh, Hollywood and a lot of things, you know. And uh, the answer to that question is I want to be happy. You know. So the first time I encountered my spiritual teacher who was a dad like me at that time I was a student, I said uh, I, I I want a, I want Porsche, you know. I said I don't care. I just want that car. <laughs> you right? Man, you're my shoe. You know? <laughs> you were, I say, I want Porsche. I don't care whether it makes me happy or not that the car I want. No matter what, I want that car. You know, I'm going to work hard to drive that car. You know? And that guy quietly said, you, you don't want a Porsche. You want to be happy. And you think that Porsche will make you happy? See, isn't it? I thought about it. I said, yes, I thought that what should make me happy. You know? And he said, well, then we can dive a little bit. Your strong desire for push to something that can also provide you happiness. You know? So I found that through his explanation that actually our physical wants are so diverse, but they all converge to 